Clycock. Hello, YouTubers, and all those who happen to watch. I'm going to get that stuck in your skull until you want to shoot me. Alright, so I've been tagged by CMC Midnight. The man with the sad eyes. He really does have sad eyes. I mean, he has a, a, those eyes like to say, come and give me a hug kind of eyes, you know. You hear that, ladies? Anywho, um, so I've been tagged some crazy game console vaginal pus thingy majigger. Now, I don't keep up to date anymore with the tags because they get ridiculous trying to keep up with everyone who does these tags, but I was checking my latest subscriptions and I saw him and I was like, oh, alright, see what he did. So I checked and I was like, ah, this is like a Rickroll, but worse. But, alright, so basically, a couple, three systems I like with five games and all that crap. They only stacked it up anymore. But, uh, disclaimer is I'm not going to tag anyone. I'm trying to kill, I'm trying to kill it off altogether. I ain't trying to do any more, make people suffer anymore because I don't think people have any more systems they like. So, makes it easier to everyone else. So, alright. Three systems I like. I'll just name you off three systems I like. It's going to be really quick. Uh, handhelds I like are the Neo Geo Pocket Color. It's one of my favorite handhelds. PSP is dead second, but next to the DS. So, you know, I can't really pick between those two, so number one choice anyway was Neo Geo Pocket Color because I just love it because it stood out all from the, all the other handhelds even though it's supposedly a counterfeit uh, Game Boy Color though personally I feel like it has its better charm than the Game Boy Color plus a quickie directional pad alright so next one with those is uh the game two games I actually own next to the I'll just name three uh, Dark Arms and the sec the first mission for Metal Slug and Metal Slug second mission. So those are the three games I actually like for the handheld so far. I'm still gonna dab into more of them because obviously I don't mess around with emulators too much with those type of handhelds. I'd rather play them. All right. So next console I enjoy is the Famicom. You guessed it. I loves me some Famicoms. Because it's Japanese, I can't understand a damn word that's going on in the game, and it makes it more challenging. Plus, the games on the darn thing are even more challenging than most typical uh, American copies of the games. And plus, it's, you know, from the motherland of Japan. So, yes, it must be done. Okay. A couple games I like from those is Soul Blade... Soul Brain, um, I can't pronounce the rest of it, but it's basically the Japanese version of Shatter Hands. I really love that version versus the uh, American version, even though the American version has got the cool sunglasses. Uh, next game I really enjoy, next two from that is one and two of this one. Taro Taro Fantastic World, really great series. And... King Kong 2, I really enjoy that one. Also, the Japanese version of Karna. Alright, so the third and last system I really enjoy is the Turbo Graphics 16. I'm just going to go with the series because it's easier for me to name off the uh, games because it's Lords of Thunder, which is of course the CD ROM attachment. I like uh, Bonks. I like Kadash. Well, let me see. That was Lord of Thunder, Bonk, Kadash, Blazing Lasers, and the last one is shoot went blank. Dragon Spirit. There we go. Even though I like the sequel for it a lot more than the uh, Dragon Spirit because like the sequel to it just mind fuckery is basically what I could put it as but all right that was basically my three consoles I like I'm not too specific on the details but that's basically what games systems in games I enjoy from those systems
you know, not typical consoles that, you know, you every day see or hear about, but they're not mainstream, and that's what I like about them, aside from the, the uh, Famicom. Famicom has a lot of games that are pretty great. Sadly, they never made it towards the shores of America. So, again, I'm not tagging anybody, because I don't feel like I need to. And, uh, that's about it. So... Take it easy, folks, and thank you guys so much for watching.